Welcome to another exciting edition of the CT Files. I'm your host, CT. All right, first and foremost, I'd like to apologize to Mr. Jose Fortunell. Sorry about that, buddy. I talked to your teacher. She said we can get you back enrolled in the class. There you go. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at this week's mail. I got one for Mr. Ernie Vasquez. CT Files, stem, stem, stem cell research? Come on, man. CT is the worst hits on student. Give me something right, all right? Jeez. All right, this is from Mr. Buster Doors. It reads, hey, CT. Well, I'm a big fan of your show, the CT Files. But as an avid OCTV viewer and longtime student, it has come to my attention that after the OC clock tower was erected, <clears throat> the body of Dr. Manuel Lopez was hidden inside. I'm afraid to venture up through LS8 alone. So I sent you this letter along with some homemade cookies. It's silly, but not yours. Buster Doors. All right, Mr. Doors. I'm gonna go ahead and take this one under my wing. I'd like to present to you the CT files. Let's do it. First, I had to talk to OC students about the mythical Dr. Lopez Tower. Yeah, we think it's Dr. Lopez's casket, cause it's dedicated to him. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what do you think is up there in that tower? That clock tower? All those gears and a bell. I believe the same thing too. That's why there's so many cats because they're looking for their owner and they're just trying to find them. We've got some skulls from anthropology down at the bottom part of the campus and here's a secret that no one knows. There are actual bodies that are connected to those skulls and they are locatable on campus. You guys know the rumor about the clock tower? What that rumor? Dr. Lopez's body is actually buried in there? Dr. Lopez? <laughs> yeah, Dr. Lopez. He's still alive. He's actually teaching a class right now. Yeah. You serious? Yeah. <laughs> well, that myth is busted. I still didn't have a good feeling about the clock tower though. I don't know if it was just me, but something didn't seem right. I arranged to speak with OC janitor, excuse me, custodian Ernesto Gonzalez, who has arranged to let my television crew up in the Forbidden Tower. So how many years have you been working here? I've been working here for two years. Okay, in those two years, have you seen anything strange up in the clock tower at all? Actually, yes. I get a really strange vibe going over there. I mean. Lately, things have been disappearing, and strange things have been going on. What was that? Um, I don't... Did... Oh... I think, um... Oh, 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 oh. So, who we are, right before the clock tower. So, tell me, what are we going to experience when we go up there? CT, to tell you the truth, I'm not going up there with you. What? Sorry, man. This one's all you. Uh, all right. Good luck. Here you go. Yo, whoa, 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 whoa. What the? Sorry guys, um, that wasn't supposed to happen. What the f CT? Tune in next time for the thrilling conclusion of The CT Files.